Danger is hanging over the heads of the characters on Weeds, particularly our protagonist, Nancy Botwin, uh, who uh, has showed up to see her boyfriend uh, with an ultrasound in some sort of attempt to not be killed. And uh, credits roll, and here we are. Oh, and I seem to be in love with her. <laughs> Doug has sort of alerted me to the fact that I might have feelings for my sister-in-law. It's been a long time since my brother died. There's got to be some sort of statute of limitations on when you can try to get in his wife's pants. So, um, yeah, I, uh, I think that uh, I like Nancy. Yeah, I mean, what's not to like? If Nancy was pregnant, uh, it would probably be a tough one for Andy to swallow at this very moment. The spawn of a gangster growing inside the woman that I love, when I would like to fill her with some sort of baby of my own. But maybe I could get one in right after this one, I suppose, and we'll have a whole brood running around. I'm sure Nancy will use this pregnancy, if she's pregnant, to her advantage, as she does pretty much everything, uh, particularly when she's dealing with people of the male species. She uh, opens her eyes up wide, a la Mary Louise Parker, and things seem to go her way. <laughs> Jennifer Jason Lee. She is uh, Nancy's sister. They're not the best of friends, but in a moment uh, where Nancy fears for the safety of her children, she uh, suddenly finds herself needing Jill's assistance. And so uh, I go up to see her with Shane, and um, hilarity ensues. To me, the story of Weeds is the continuing rise of Nancy Botwin through the ranks of criminality. But as we saw last year, when we completely changed locations and burned down our previous setting, uh, there's nowhere to go but forward, and I think uh, if you're lucky enough to be on a television series that lasts for a while, uh, you have to do that, otherwise you're screwed. You have to keep moving onward and upward, and you need to keep it becoming a new show every year, and so, uh, so far we've been doing that, I think. Mm -hmm.